All right, what is good, everybody on YouTube? So as you can see from the title and the thumbnail, we got an unboxing, we got a review to do. But before we get there, we got two shoes that we got to drop off at USPS and then one at UPS. One we sold on StockX and then the other we sent into a friend of a friend. So we're going to take y'all with us today. Let's go ahead and get there, get these shoes shipped, and then talk about more shoes. All right, let's go. So we just dropped off the first package. I forgot to tell y'all what shoes we was actually even dropping off. So the ones we just dropped off is the shoes we're going to review. When we get back to the house, there's an extra pair for a friend of a friend. And then what I got in the back seat is some dunks I got a long time ago. Some pure platinum dunks. They had like some type of like rope lacing. I'm gonna post a picture of them because I don't really feel like getting them out the box. But now we gotta head to Office Depot because our apartment complex be playing when they try to print stuff off of us. They'll be printer don't work never so we got to pay that little 60 cent to get our stuff printed off i'd rather pay that 30 cents and then call it a day we will use the printer that we have at home but that's for a different story. I hate that printer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, William. Hello, everyone. Be safe. Thank you, Don't be getting too mad at them drivers out there now. I need you to come home safe to me. All right. All right. All right Sounds good. Thank you. Too. Oh yeah, I, I'm already know. All right, y'all, let's open up these shoes. So uh, let's get it. All right, y'all, so we are back at the house now and we got a package to open, obviously. So let's grab it. But we got that bad boy right here. The package in directly from Nike. These Jordan 4s released this past Saturday, 27th, what's it, Thursday? I'm not exactly entirely for sure, but box, nothing too crazy, nothing too out of the ordinary. Golly. All right, let's take them out. So, we have the Jordan 4 Retro Wet Cement. Now, first things first, we're going to get into the box. Golly, they destroyed it. First thing they you're going to know if you did body shoes, the box has like a sandpaper type of feel. Now, the Jumpman this time is a little bit different. Instead of like a print, it's like a, a glossy finish right here. So, like, you can only see it in certain points of the light. So, as you can see, it says flight. Flight with the Jumpman symbol. That's the size tag. That's what it reads there. 11 and a half which is my size now originally this wasn't going to be for me it was for a friend but i was able to let him know when these restock because these restock a bunch of times within the first few days of it releasing and he was able to get his own pair so now i have the option if i want to keep these or if i want to sell these right here we go i don't like when they do this it's extra paper for no reason i get it when they do it with the special because this shoe retailed at 225 plus tax but then they add this extra layer of paper i'm like bro i just want to see what the shoe look like i'm sorry i've looked at uh the other pair that we that we already shipped out for somebody else and i don't want to say this isn't a bad shoe, right? But the way how sneakers is now, it's so many releases coming out, right? But just look at this. The Jordan 4 wet cements. These are nice, y'all. can't even hold y'all. Like, these are definitely nice. If you wanted these, you should, should be able to get these. I would try hitting up some of your local stores, honestly. You may still be able to get them in hand. Let's go ahead and get a quick little breakdown on this pair here. So when it comes to the wet cement, this is gonna be a little bit different than your ordinary Jordan 4. So as you can already see from the tongue, tongue tag with the flight on there, stamped into the actual tongue itself. So real good quality there. The laces are a little bit different. I don't know how I feel about it because as you can see, they're kind of rough. 
I don't think this pair is like that though. Maybe it's just that one. It's not too bad. I already talked about the laces. Now on the side, you actually don't get any net in here. So on the traditional Jordan 4, this would be like a plastic material netting. But for this, it's just with this new bug material that's kind of like stamped in the shape of the netting that you normally have. The wings has like that concrete cement type of paint splatter on there. It's also like that for the back for the Jumpman symbol. For the bottom is just an all gray also with the lighter gray Jumpman on the bottom. But outside of the other materials, you have the cement print on the back, the wing size, you know, the bottoms. We talked about the tongue, talked about the laces. Now let's get into the front. So the toe box here has like uh, this crack leather. It kind of looks like crack leather, but it's low key kind of smooth to the touch. It's not like the hard crack leather that you've seen before, like on the the taupe haze for us. If I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, they had crack leather on it. So that front part is gonna have some crack leather on it, as you see there. The new bug on these is super soft to the touch. They kind of show some type of motion, not motion, but like movement when you touch it. That's always a good sign of good quality there. What's the for is y'all let me know if y'all ended up copying these. Do you like them? Do you hate them? These have been compared to the cause fours because of the similarity in grays all across the whole entire shoe. Y'all let me know if that's something that you are rocking with. Kind of split opinions when it comes to this. There's there's been people that have been passing on these, people that aren't really that big of a fan of them. I'm curious in the comment section, y'all let me know. Other than that, before we get up out of here, I do want to talk about where I want to essentially take this channel, right? So I do want to announce that me and my wife have a official travel channel, all right? I'm going to leave links in the description. I want y'all to check it out. I only have a few vlogs up there, but if you're interested in travel videos, and it's, it's gonna be completely separated away from sneakers, all right? It's gonna be strictly traveling, travel tips, travel vlogs, how to get the best prices on flights and things of that nature. We have that channel. It is called Get Away With The Groves. So the link is in the description. Y'all check that channel out, subscribe to that channel. We should have three videos up, depending on when you're watching this. The most recent playlist that I am creating currently is our Italy playlist. Early in the, earlier within June, we went to Italy and different parts of Italy. So you'll get a sprinkle of what we did in those different cities in Italy. And yeah, like that's pretty much it. That's all I really want to talk about. Y'all stay tuned for the next vlog. Like I said, this is a quick shoe. They already came out Saturday. We didn't do a pickup vlog. Upcoming sneakers that are releasing, we do have the Amamani Air 4s that are releasing. It's a lighter version of what I've already covered in a previous video of mine, where I've reviewed the Amamani Air 4s. The Olympic 6s are coming out this weekend, which is gonna be August 3rd. Yeah, today's the first, second. Yeah, it's gonna be August 3rd. Olympic 6s, a lot of OGs are excited about that colorway. I know I, the last time I seen it when I was back in high school, I'm not gonna tell you when that is, but it was back when I was in high school. If you know when they dropped, you know what time frame that is. It's been a while for them to come out. So that is it. We got some upcoming shoes. It's your boy Moody. I appreciate y'all for watching. Make sure to get away with the Gross channel. If you're interested into any travel, Links in the description, y'all. I appreciate y'all for watching as always. We gonna get on out of here. Hopefully y'all enjoy some of this B-roll. Please hit that like button because it is hot here in Houston. Recording this video today outside. If you, in the, if you outside anything longer than 10 minutes, just know it's ridiculous. It's actually crazy. But I'm gonna get on out of here. Appreciate y'all for watching as always. I'm gone.